Luke tells us that immediately, while he was still speaking, he heard the sound of a rooster crow. And in that instant, instant, the Lord turned and looked straight at Peter with one unforgettable stare from Jesus. A fuse was ignited in Peter's mind. But the devastating explosion occurred when he remembered the words Jesus had told him just a few hours ago. Before the rooster crows today, you will deny me three times. Peter was immediately convicted of sin. Not only of his denial of Jesus, but also the pride that led him to think that he could never deny him. He walked away from the crowd and kept walking. And when he was finally alone in the darkness, he wept bitterly. And I imagine every moan and tear growing more intense as his own words kept playing over and over again in his mind like a broken record. I'm ready to go with you, both to prison and to death. The affliction he was now experienced must have been overwhelming and unbearable. And yet, even as Peter found himself drowning in a sea of tears, he wasn't without hope. Christian brothers and sisters, you need to hold on to this hope as well. Even when you've fallen into a hole so deep that there doesn't seem to be a way out, 